Today's telecast is presented live from Baltimore Scaryland in Red b and Spank Stadium for today's game. The stadium is sold out and the atmosphere is electric. The fans want to see some hard-hitting carnage, <laughs> and so do I. I heard the city was famous for crabs, so if you get lucky tonight, Grim, make sure you take a shampoo with that Quell lotion and see a doctor. Today's matchup is going to be complete mayhem. The teams are taking the field. The Cincinnati Bengals battle. The Baltimore Razors. Welcome to MFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. Yo, man, nobody can touch me when I fall. I take all you mutants out. That's right. What you talking about? Hope you got your mutant tailgate buzz on. I know I did. The teams are revving up on the sidelines, and we are ready for some mutant football. Grim Blitzer along with Bricks and Bricks Jr. Yeah, Grim, I had a little eye open at myself at the mutant bloodmobile park next to the taco truck outside. Called a lobotomy shot. Raccoon rabies blood and red bull crap. Hoo-hoo. Yeah, I can tell your mom looks like a hot shaving cream dispenser. <laughs> And it's first and ten. Tired of the quarterback's tight spirals and magnetic personality. The defense... Now the QB has to try to run out of bounds before they get to him. Needless to say, with seven crazed defenders coming after him, that's not easy. Ah, the old quarterback shellac play. Yeah. And it's first and ten. Ouch! What is this, 80s wrestling? Hey, you see that move, baby? No, you didn't. You know why? I'm too fast for you. I'm the greatest. The greatest, I tell you. <laughs> Second down and two. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. 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 Third and four. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Knock the wind out of that quarterback. Hey, man, I was hanging on the now. They all have. <laughs> Ballsy? Stupid, maybe? I guess we'll decide after we see how this goes. But probably still. And he just used his beast boost dirty trick, and there's no way to stop him. Unless, of course, you kill him. Wow, look at that freak go! He's unstoppable! Fumble! You've got to protect the ball better than that. The defense comes up with the ball! Pow! And how about a little dirt sandwich? was good for 10 yards. Second down the size of Bricks Wiener. Hey! Sorry, partner. And he rumbles into the end zone for the score. I hope he's not going to dance. Hmm. I don't remember that being an officially sanctioned NFL rule.
Second down and 10. And the offense jumps off sides to kill the ref. They say, we're mad as hell and not going to take it anymore. Second down and ain't going to happen, partner. One, hot two, three. That, my friends, was an all-pro NFL hit. Third down and forever. unit you know punters really do know how to party bricks yeah oh yeah i have pictures that uh that, well maybe actually shouldn't discuss this on here and he just lets that one go he says no thank you and the defense downs it and it's first and ten hot one hot two hot three oh with the brutal hit And that'll bring up second and one. And that's a nice run for a first down. And it's first and ten. Hot one, hot two, hot, hot, hot. hot. And he picks up eight yards on a strong run. Second down and two. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, 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 hot. Just follow the bloody footprints to the new line. That's a first down. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot. Good run for five yards. Hey, didn't move the change of score, did it? How good can it be? Second down and five. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot three. And then Catch will give them a first down. I don't know if they're his, but he sure has a good set of hands. And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one, hot two, hot three. If that hit didn't cripple him, it certainly left skid marks. Second and three. Hot three. And the ball is lateral to his teammate. We're talking street. I've seen this guy run through a brick wall. He loves pain. First down. First down and six. And into the end zone with a burst of speed. I think he's more of a downest guy than a speed feed grip. He's running from his team, it's clear. <laughs> well, little chip shot here, extra point, but... I could blow it. Straight through the uprights. Let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever. First and ten. Oh, mama! He just knocked him into the next time zone! Once he finds his head, he'll be okay! Second down and ten. He 
was stuffed at the line of scrimmage. It's anyone's game at the end of quarter one. Third down and ten. And they'll line up for the punt here. And he booted a high arcing rainbow. And he's got a chance for a good return here. Oh, nice hit. First and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two. Hot. And the ground game is starting to soften up the defense. First down. First and ten. And the defense goes for the jugular and rushes to kill the quarterback. I can't look. You know, it's not how many times you fall. It's how you get back up. Yeah, in this particular case, I'm thinking defibrillators and 100 cc's of adrenaline. Yeah, they ball wouldn't hurt either. Did somebody say cocaine? And it's first and ten. and catch for three. The receiver needs to break some tackles. Second down and seven. I just may be on commentary, but I thought you were supposed to throw the ball forward. You're right, you should. And that'll bring up third down and seven. And the quarterback finds his man for the first down. First down and three. Ooh, hope he's got a good chiropractor. Second and three. Oh, he just got crushed. Bring up third and one. And the crowd goes wild. Touchdown! Touchdown! Some who would argue that we should just skip this step and make touchdowns worth seven. What, and kick the kicker's job in half? They'd just be called sinners then. It's good. Here comes the kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were going to tell me a story like, here's the kicker. When I turned on the light, it wasn't a brawn in my bed. It was a chip wearing a wig. And it's 
first and ten. Looks like the defense called the ginormous dirty trick. And oh, welcome to Fumbletown, USA. Population, this guy. Boy, he should be more careful when he hurdles. And he finds open spaces running toward the end zone. Turn on your jets, you son of a bitch. Well, this should be an easy chip shot extra point, but you never know with kickers. <laughs> Kidding me? My sister could have made that kick. The home team is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five. He took a beast boost injection. Now watch him stop all over his opponents. I want to take a beast boost injection too. Uh, now that is weird side effects, Briggs. And that's a first down. Looks like they're just going to pound it up the middle all night, Briggs. I call that the honeymoon offense. I'm not going to touch that one. That's what she said. Come on, man, you can't hang with me. You get my grill, I'm gonna ruin your world. You understand me? Don't make any mistakes here, or they'll kick the shit out of you in the locker room. And he misses that extra point. Oh, well, look at clown shoes down there. Is he wearing actual clown shoes? I think so. It's probably why he missed. They need a good return here to set up the offense. Not a bad kick, but not a great one either. Well, his nickname is Lukewarm. And he's proud of that? Yeah, that's why he named his clothing company Lukewarm Threads. Their marketing team hates it. He's too full of pop down but blew out his flip flop. Not to mention his insides. Wasted away and getting new, Phil. The kicker just ended up in the meat wagon. They'll need to find another player on their bench who can kick field goals. Good luck with that. And it's first and ten. And he sends him to the ground with an exclamation point. And a well-placed cleat. First time out under two minutes. The chess game has begun. It's like chess only. You can kill people. Second down and two. Hey, man, nobody can touch me when I ball. I take all you mutants out. That's right. Hey, what you talking about, Pop? And the offense quickly calls their second timeout. That's how you do it. Do what? And the offense goes into their two-minute drill. Which coincidentally happens to be Brick's match stupsing time. That's why the girls call me Speedy Gonzalez. 
Thomas! First down! I've seen this guy drop a lot of balls in the past, but I heard the quarterback threaten. Hey, timeouts are kind of like condoms, you know, Grim? You gotta use them smart if you want to score. Let's see if they did. And the quarterback goes into a hurry-up offense and calls all the plays from the line of scrimmage from here on out. Second down and nine. Well, he made the pass, but then a slap in the face by the defense. Ah, oh, that's me in the hotel bar every night. Hey, your opening line needs work. Why? Really? What's a pretty girl like you doing here all by herself? Are you a hooker? Well, it's a fair question. And the defense anticipated a pass there and put an end to their offensive drive. Like my wife always said, not tonight. And it's first and ten. That run is good for 10 yards. And that's the end of the second quarter. Someone will need to pull together some bribe money as they head to their lockers. Stay with us for the halftime show, brought to you by our friends at Monsatan Industries. We make genetically altered Franken food you'll have fun trying to identify. The teams line up for the kickoff to start the second half. These guys will have to play a lot harder to make it a game. Yeah. Well, either that or kill and cheat more. When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make them pay. with the punishing hit. And it's first and ten. Oh, and the quarterback threads the needle for a first down. And it's first and ten. I personally think that the ginormous guy is compensating for something, but I won't be the one to tell him. That's the way to move the chains. That's good for a first down. This game is all about momentum and killing. First down and seven. And he runs into the end zone for a touchdown. <laughs> and here comes the extra point attempt. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. Let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever.
personal offense says it's time to put the ref out of his misery. First down and a mile, and the defense jumps offside trying to mutilate the QB. And the whistle blows the play dead along with the quarterback. They're back up here on first down. want some payback after that and that'll bring up third and one and this guy runs angry and runs hard first down and it's first and ten Whenever a player gets big like this, it reminds me of that Tom Hanks movie. And that's a sack. Speaking of sacks, has anybody seen my powder? I'm itching like crazy over here. See that move, baby? I'm the greatest. No, you didn't see that because I'm too fast. <laughs> and watch his confidence take off. He is deadly in the open field, Bricks. And it's first and ten. Yeah, you think you can go toe-to-toe -to -toe with me? Well, you mistaken, man. You get up my grill, I'm gonna ruin your world. I'm gonna wreck it. Ain't gonna happen, partner. The QB looks angry at his offensive line, and I can't blame him. Yo, man, nobody can touch you when I ball. I take all you mutants out. That's right. What you talking about? Third down, and the offense needs a miracle. No, you didn't. You know why? I'm too fast for you. I'm the greatest. The greatest, I tell you. <laughs> Don't do anything stupid here. Just punt the damn ball and play defense. And he put all of his foot into that one. And he snags the punt and looks for open field. I had a dog being snagged. He got hit by a car and died. Oh, and that one's going to hurt. He may not be able to comprehend math after that hit. What's math? Exactly. And it's first and ten. Tired of the quarterback's tight spirals and magnetic personnel. And in some leagues, you aren't even allowed to touch the QB. In the NFL, they have plays just for killing them. <laughs> That's what I'm talking about. First and ten. And he held on to that one for a first down. And it's first and ten. And he rumbles for nine on that play. And that'll 
that'll bring up second and one. Oh, and that's when it feels like to have your teeth removed without Novocaine. If I had all my teeth knocked out like that, I'd have them made at the dice grin. It'd be fun to gamble with my own teeth. <laughs> and he just used his beast boost dirty trick, and there's no way to stop him. And he breaks through for a touchdown. Listen to this crowd! Yay! <laughs> okay, nice and easy like a two-foot putt. You miss two-foot putts all the time, Grim! It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuffed burrito from Taco Hell. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if the defense can hold them. And that's a returnable ball. Returnable? You mean he can get a refund for it? No, no, Brickton. It means he can return it for You know what? Never mind. but he still picked up a yard somehow. <laughs> Second down and nine. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. One time when I was playing, a guy hit me so hard, I went into a dark tunnel. Thought I saw my grandparents waving at me in the light. Turns out it was just the visitor's tunnel that he knocked me into, and it was the paramedics waving fingers in my face. That's the end of the third quarter. And look, folks, I'll be honest, I don't see a chance in hell in here. And the offense goes into a hurry-up to pick up the pace of the game. Until not and he picks up a new set of downs. And it's first and ten. That's the way to keep the chains moving. That was beautiful. And it's first and ten. heard footsteps and took his eye off the ball. What a peck ahead. Get the ball, asshole. Time to speed things up. The offense goes into a two-minute drill. And he zips that one in there for a touchdown. And this werewolf is from London, I believe, signed in the offseason. His hair was perfect. Better watch out. He'll rip your lungs out, Bricks. <laughs> well, this should be easy, but with kickers, you never know. And the easiest play in the league, and he chokes. Yeah, he's a choker. When you get knocked down, you gotta get right back up and fight. Uh, what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run. And it's first and ten. Seven yards on that play.
Second and three. point but you never know with kickers <laughs> Sounds like what, Grim? Sounds like the asshole I'm living on. And it's first and ten. Hot one. Hot. That ball just sliced through the defense like butter. Nicely done for a first down. The offense calls a timeout. This is why you save your timeouts. You can use them in the two-minute warning. Now I get it. Makes sense, Grim. The quarterback goes into a hurry-up offense. He's looking for a quick score. Aren't we all, Grim? Aren't we all? Well, that's a real buzzkill. And he's able to grab that one somehow and hold on for the first down. This guy has a nice set of hands, Grim. It's the third set of hands he's had so long today. Looks like... The offense is running low on quarterbacks. They have only two left. He might consider running the ball more. Well, that's two timeouts burned. And you have to wonder, Bricks, are they desperate or are they in control? Well, I'm speaking from experience, Grim, but it really is hard to do both at the same time. And I have mastered it. And that was a perfect pass, and he scores handily. Fancy here. Just 
kick it. In that order, Grim? Straight through the uprights. Looks like they're lined up for an onside kick. You usually only talk about kickers when they win or lose games. Well, this guy just earned his paycheck, which is typically the amount the quarterback tips on dinner. The quarterback shifts gears and goes into his hurry-up offense. This guy's going to get mugged in the locker room by his team after the game. In a hurry-up offense, there is no huddle, so neither team can put their players on the bench. And he just nailed him right on the numbers for a touchdown. If you think his dancing is bad, you should have been here in the old days. He used to mark their territory the old-fashioned way. But they agreed to dial it down to uh, interpretive dance. I took an interpretive dance class with a werewolf on Grim. He damn near clawed my face off. Well, that was before the class even started. And these guys think kicking is for pussies, Bricks. They're going for two. Yeah, they got big balls, Grim. Yeah, bigger than yours. And that's a good by the number throw. And those numbers add up to two. Nobody can touch you with eyeball. I take all you mutants out. That's right. Hey, what you talking about? They'll be going on site here, and the return team is ready for it. No surprises here. And that, ladies and mutants, is how you recover an onside kick. And the offense goes into the hurry-up formation to try to conserve time. Oh, big catch! Big run! Big touchdown! Yeah, big deal. Mr. Meeper breaks me with a ball and didn't fall out. Some who would argue that we should just skip this step and make touchdowns worth seven. What, they get the kicker's job in half? They'd just be called sitters then. The kick is good! And as expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. Looks like they're lined up for an onside kick. Uh, I thought they were going to do some sort of chorus line. The four people on the planet who care about rules and kickoffs must be happy to see a flag down. The onside kick is a desperation play, but it's their only chance at this point to steal a possession. Stealing ain't right, Grim. It just ain't right. And it's first and ten. a six-yard gain. Hey, do me a favor. If my parole officer calls, I was with you last night, Bricks. No, no more timeouts for the defense. Or the offense, Bricks. That's, that's the important part. I hope some lucky fan gets to catch the ball. This is going to be a great kick. With how hard he's going to have to kick it, they'd probably die, Bricks. Pass me the binoculars. I Man, this is a tough league. When your kicker dies, they've got to bring a backup off the... Throw some more razors, win at home. And that's like waking up next to a beautiful girl after a night of drinking. Oh, <laughs> bonus. The entire game was trench warfare. Both teams battling back and forth, bruised and battered. But in the end, there could be only one winner. There are winners in my book. I think that a few teams should get a participation award because yeah, I tried really hard. Why don't you try real hard and shut the fuck up? Nice mouth. Why don't you try to lay off the scotch, Junior? Suck on it. Real nice. Let's go to the...
the game's MVP. <laughs> Once again, the folks at Evil SN thank our viewing audience and the Mutant Football League for allowing us to telecast this sports presentation. This is Grim Blitzrow with Brickhead Mulligan and Bricks Jr. signing off. Today's game was brought to you by Comcrack Entertainment. They're not happy until you're not happy.